Derek, your mom over there looking nice. Keep talking about my mom, it's gonna be a problem. Boy, I'll smack you. Yeah, I wish you would smack me. Matter of fact, let me pray for you real quick. Dear Heavenly Father, please have Chad work up the nerve to put his hands on me. I want him, I really, really want him to put his hands on me. Oh yeah? Lord, I was wrong. This this is not what I want at all. If you could just intervene, please come down and maybe stop Chad's hands from doing that again. If you if you could just have him disappear, Lord, that would be really really nice. He's still here, Lord. Hello, Derek. What's up? What's up, Chad? You ready for tonight? Yeah, I'm ready, man. It's gonna be so fun. This is our first date. It's not a date. It's kind of like a date. It's nothing like a date. Well, it's at a restaurant. It's just two of us. So what does that mean? So it's like a date. No, it's not. Remember when you went out with Sarah? That was a date. Yeah, that was a date. So what's the difference? She was my girlfriend, Derek. Uh, it's still a date. Whatever, just fine. It's a date. Cool. I fuck on the first date, just so you know. So wear something nice. It's not a hard question. Who took the $5 out of my room? I ain't a snitch, so I ain't saying anything. Yeah, me either. I am not a snitch. What is this? Are you, are you saying Derek did it? Damn, he caught you, bro. Shoot. Dear Amy, you are the love of my life. I don't know what I would do if I ever lost you. You mean the world to me, and I love you more than anything. Yo, Derek. Huh? Amy said let you know that that it's over and she don't want to go out with you anymore. That's that's fine. I don't even like her that much anyway. I, I was probably going to break up with her on Tuesday. Really? Is it cool if I go out with her? Say it again. Bro, 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 bro. Say it again. I'm, I'm kidding. I'm joking. Relax. I'm, I'm joking. <laughs> well, don't. Don't joke like that. Not about Amy. I won't say it anymore. Definitely not about Amy. You think you'll be allowed to go? I don't know. I'll find out. Hold on. Thanks for calling 1-800-LIVE-GIRLS. How can I make you scream today, Daddy? Mom. Yeah? Hey, can I go to Chad's? We're gonna go to the movies with his mom. Um, sure. Where's your dad at? I don't know. He's not home. Okay, have fun. Okay, love you. Love you too. Bye. All right, so I can go. I just got to see if I have my... Miss Banks, hey, I can tell you how you can make me scream. You guys have ice cubes? Hello? What's up, Chad? I just got back from the doctors. I had to get a shot. Yeah, they had to stick it in my butt. Yeah, at first I was like, you guys ain't gonna give me a shot in my butt. And they kept saying that they had to, so finally I just pulled down my pants and I was like, go ahead and stick it in, but just be easy because I know it's gonna hurt. And so I close my eyes and I'm holding on to his arms and he gives me my shot. And it hurt. I cried. I did. But they gave me a sucker. Yep. So I'm sitting there and I'm sucking on that and he's rubbing my back and he's just like, are you okay? And I'm like, I'm fine. No, my mom was there. She saw everything. Yeah. No, she, was, she said that she said that she used to cry when she got shots. Chad, what's up? Do you think you can help me with my homework real quick? Yeah, 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 but did you hear about Miss Parker? What? They're saying she slept with Kevin. Fuck out of here. Bro, I'm dead serious. Nice. Right? Ain't that crazy? Hell yeah, I fucked the shit out of Kevin. Wait, But what? seriously, this homework, do you think that Benjamin Franklin had three- Derek. Yeah. I got an idea how to make money so we can get a PlayStation 5. We're gonna record a series and then send it into Netflix and see if we can get a deal. That's perfect. Derek interviews firemen with their shirts off. No, we're gonna Derek do... interviews firemen with their shirts off partially. No, what? I'm trying Can to... they have their pants unbuttoned? No. Can it be Derek interviews firemen with their shirts pulled down and you can kind of see them? No, name? we're gonna do like, like, like the news. Like, I'm gonna do sports and I'll talk about like basketball and football and you can talk about the weather. Weather? Okay. Record me. Yeah, I'll record you. <clears throat> Today it's going to be 95 degrees in your area. It's going to be very hot and sunny. Yeah, perfect, bro, perfect. Probably, probably, probably be a good day for, for a fireman to take their shirts off if it gets hot and you want to take them off. Just take them off. Come on. And now to chat on sports. Go ahead. You're pretty. You're so pretty. You're going to be so pretty for today. You're going to have so much fun. Huh? 
Hello? Not it. Just get ready for today. Put some rose petal mist on. Cause what Dane said. I don't think so. I think he means like he's gonna like put his hands on my like... I think you're wrong. Dad. Yeah. Hey, Dane said when he sees me today, he's gonna put his hands on me. Does that mean like he's gonna like touch me like centrally or does he- He's gonna beat your ass, Derek. Okay, you was right. He's gonna beat my ass. Hey, let me call you back. Hello? Hey, I had a dozen roses under banks. You can cancel those. The I love you balloon? Yeah, cancel that too. Cancel everything. Derek, I got this rap, but I can't figure out the last line. Can you help? Yeah, okay, let's hear it. Check it. Up in the club and it's looking real nice. Chilling with the girls, got a bitch by my side. Um, looking to my right and it looked like there's a twerk off. Uh... Hold on, let me say it, let me say it again. I'm up in the club and it's looking real nice. Chilling right here, got a girl to my side. Looking to my right and it looked like there's a twerk off. Let's call some firemen and have them take their shirts off. Firemen with their shirts off, man. The fuck? Firemen with their shirts off. And not just firemen, but any men. Plenty men. Talking about all these really nice and pretty men. Okay, never mind. Never mind. You don't like firemen? I thought you were gonna call the escort service. I am. Shut up. Hello? Hello? Hi. Is this the escort service? Yes, it is. Hey, me and my friend was wondering how much to have sex. Five hundred dollars. It's five hundred dollars. Five hundred dollars? We don't have that shit. Ask, ask if we just touch our boobs. How much is it if we could just touch our boobs? Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars? Fifty dollars. Damn, that's still too much. Hey, what can we do for four nickels? Yeah. Kiss my ass. Deal. We can kiss her ass. Okay. Hello? She hung up. But we can kiss her ass. Get my nickels. Bro, that's your mom. I know that's my mom. I know what she looks like. Dad. Mr. Banks, mom, your wife. She's, she's, I should take a hand that she looks at. I remember she goes down in the corner on Fridays. Remember she's down there. She's 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 okay, 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 okay. One at a time. I can't understand you. Mom's on TV. And new at five o'clock, a local prostitution sting. Police releasing this video footage earlier today. Oh my gosh. Wow, she stuck that whole thing in her. Well, hey, Chad. Hey, Mom. Hey, uh, Mom, this is Derek. Derek, this is my mom. Hey, Chad's mom. Hello, Derek. You know my mom. Yes, I do. Yep. She said that you're a whore and you sleep with everybody's husband. Derek, what the fuck? What? Your mother's a whore and she sleeps with everyone's husband, according to my mom. <sighs> Sorry you had to find out this way, but she's, she's a whore. That sucks. <laughs> Of course you would say that. You know he's married. Well, I hope she don't mess up. Because if he's, if he's doing this to me at his shows, obviously he feels something. He feels nothing. You don't know that. Oh God! All right, so what happened? So Amy comes back to my house after school and my parents aren't there and we're up in my room. And she was like, let's play nurse. And then she was like, I'll be the nurse and you be the patient. And so she has me lay on the bed and then she's like, she's checking my chest and then she just reaches down and she kisses me. What'd you do? I pushed her off me. I said, bitch, you're at work. What the fuck is wrong with you? Mr. Banks. Yeah, Chad. A girl named Courtney punched Derek in the stomach today and he cried. I didn't cry because of that. I cried because my great grandma died. Grandma Evelyn? She died 40 years ago. I know, but I, I, I was at school and I, and I was thinking of her. You've never met her. I know, but I, I started, still I was starting to think of her and then right when Courtney punched me, that's all of a sudden I was like, oh no, Grandma Evelyn died. And then, then I fell on the ground and I started shaking and I was holding my stomach because I felt like the inside of my stomach has been smashed and I, and I felt like my ribs were broke. So that's when I yelled, this is the most powerful bitch in the world because I was, I was sad because Grandma Evelyn, I miss her so much.